In this video we share Our Lady's message to Pedro Regis for February 27, 2024. Please like, comment and subscribe to assist my channel in reaching a wider audience. Thank you. Here is the message of Our Lady to Pedro for February 27. Dear children, I am your mother and I come from heaven to conduct you to my son Jesus. Be meek and humble of heart, for only thus can you achieve holiness. Listen to the voice of the Lord and let him transform you. Do not allow the things of the world lead you away from the path of salvation. Trust in Jesus. Welcome his gospel and the teachings of the true magisterium of his church. Whatever happens, always stay with the truth. The enemy of God will cause great confusion and many will lose the true faith. Many chosen to defend the truth will follow paths contrary to the faith and many will be lost eternally. I suffer for what comes to you. Bend your knees in prayer. Behold the opportune time for your return. Ye are walking towards a future in which many will desire the truth and will find only confusion and division. Courage. My Jesus needs your public and courageous witness. Onward in defense of the truth. This is the message that I transmit to you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to reunite you here once more. I bless you, in the name of the Father, of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Stay in peace. Our Lady gave a similar message to Pedro Regis on January 26, 2023. Dear children, my Jesus loves you and expects much from you. Do not allow anything or anyone to take you away from the path that I have pointed out to you. Do not be discouraged. You are living in the time of the great spiritual battle and the Lord needs you. The enemy's plan is to lead you away from the truth. They will attack the Eucharist in order to make you discouraged and lead you away from the truth. Be attentive. My Jesus is present in the Eucharist in his body, blood, soul, and divinity. Do not allow the devil to deceive you and to take this non-negotiable truth from your hearts. Whatever happens, stay with the teachings of the true magisterium of the Church of my Jesus. This is the message that I give you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to gather you here once more. I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Be at peace. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.